How's it going guys? It's Mr. Lone Wolf and uh, today I wanted to help you get this Goliath trophy because what a lot of people have done is already delivered the trailers and you can't kind of get it really unless you restart the game but you can see there Goliath I've got it and I had the same problem I'd al already delivered the trailers so I'll show you how to get around that and I'll also show you how to do the trophy if you've still got the trailer that's the trailer you need that's the only one that seems liftable with the cranes all like the coiled tube semi trailers and all that they're all too heavy so anyway first thing you want to do is obviously get a truck that's got a crane on it I've chose this Dan one you don't actually need to you can there is other options uh, I've also got a crane on this Western Star so if you've got one of these red cranes it's basically the red cranes on an American truck and the yellow ones on the Russian the reason I wanted the Dan over that Western Star is because I can put a double motor winch on this and take this as your own wrist. Don't buy it on my behalf, but I think that buying the heavier winch helps the crane a bit. But it won't matter for this anyway because you're lifting it with the arm, not the winch. So first thing you want to do is recover your truck to the garage and then retain your truck. I'll just show you quickly the winch. I've equipped it with a double motor winch which basically says it was most powerful on the game. I've tested it out, I think it makes the winch of the crane stronger, but again you don't actually need it for this situation. So retain your truck so it's stored away or what, and you can get it out on any map, and then quit to main menu. And once you're on the main menu, you want to go down to start co-op. And once you're on start co-op, you want to go to find game. Don't create a game because if you've already delivered the trailer if you create the game it'll load a game with your level of progress where the trailers are already gone. The other thing is when you click find, once I click find game it's just gonna find someone's game. I don't really get an option so you need to load up in Michigan if it's loading up a Russian or an Alaskan map then you just want to quit to main menu and find a game again because I don't believe yet you can change regions but you can change maps within a region. I had to try this four times. I lost the footage of the first half of when I originally did this, so I just re recreated the footage. Of the four times I've tried to find a game, the first one it loaded uh, Black River, but I forgot to bring a truck with a crane. The second one was Smithville Dam, where I actually did it, and then I lost the footage. The third one loaded me up on a Russian thing, but I uh, it crashed, and then the fourth one is this again. So go into your truck storage and get your truck of choice the one you've got your crane on and click leave garage as you can see now I'm on somebody's game in the bottom left corner just above my fuel there's a guy's name ID blah 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 and as you can see here he's on a Dr Drummond Island at the minute there he is he just changed his truck but that's some dude playing a game online and he's left it as public instead of private so I've been able to join I never heard him, he didn't say anything or anything like that. So it's loaded me in Smithville Dam. The place you want to go is Black River. So I think the only two maps you can get loaded into is uh, Smithville and Black River. Once you're in Black River, you want to come down this road. There's the garage in Black River, just for a reference point. And the fuel station you want to find is this one. And you can see that like greyish tube looking trailer that I'm on. You need to make sure that's there. If that's gone, quit to main menu and find a game again. And you need someone who's got that trailer there. So now what I'm going to do is uh, drive to uh, Black River. I'll cut out pretty much all the boring stuff. As I said, the guy never spoke to me or anything while I was on it. I've basically just snuck onto his map. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to borrow his trailer to complete this Goliath mission. So uh, yeah, now I'm on Black River. And I'll just uh, show you quickly. I'm going to drive. Afterwards, I thought it'd probably be quicker just to recover your truck to the garage and then come out. But I'm going to follow this road through that town, over this bridge. Luckily, he's already built the bridge. <laughs> And then I'm going to go this way, and again, luckily, he's also built that pylon back, otherwise the road will be blocked and I'd just have to go a bit of a longer way. But I'm going to follow this road, and again, we're at this fuel station, and it needs to have that grey, long-ass looking trailer there. So that's where I'm going to drive to. I'll cut most of the footage out, just to uh, save a bit of time. What you're seeing right now is me recreating this, because like I said, I lost the first half of the footage. So in about five seconds, 
the name of that guy in the bottom left is going to change and the time of day might change a little bit because I'm now going to switch back to the footage when I actually did it. So at this point now, I haven't actually got the trophy myself. This was when I just snuck onto this guy's map. As you can see, there's two of them and they were talking to each other, I think, but I couldn't hear them. And they never spoke to me or anything. I'll, uh, I'll just show you quickly. Look, there they are. If I go into the global map, there they both are on Smithville Dam and it just spawned me in here. And I just snuck off to Black River. I don't. I assume they probably know I'm on the map. Because I assume my name had come up. But And as well, while I was driving along, as you can see here, trailer discovered and then watchtower. I actually got a few points for that. That was them doing that. But anyway, I drove up to this petrol station. And as you can see, the trailer I need is there. So I'm basically just going to borrow their trailer. And you've got to lift it five metres in the air. It's pretty easy, I'll show you. Uh, the only tips I could say, you don't want much winch length, so when you actually get your crane out, put the end of your crane as close to that winching point as you can. Then connect it. If you're struggling to lift it, pull it back towards you, because the shorter the crane arm is, the easier it lifts stuff. And once you start lifting it, it sort of goes then and it's fine. Now just uh, hold R1 down and it'll lift it as high as you can. For some reason it doesn't show up when I get trophies, but I'll show you the screenshot. There it is, Trophy and Goliath. So yeah, just lift this fuel trailer in the air. And uh, that's basically it. Now, I could be a bit of a cheeky sod and just drop his trailer and bugger off, but since they haven't moaned or anything and I am kind of on their map borrowing their trailer, I'm just going to quickly put it back how I found it, just to be polite. Like I say, don't be a wanker and start annoying people and joining their games just to be a pain in the ass. Um, yeah, well, I've lifted the trailer, reversed. The only bit of advice I'd say now is recover your truck to the garage and then retain it again. Because I had a bit of a heart-stopping moment. I now just quit to main menu. Like I say, just retain your truck first and then quit to main menu. But I'm now coming back off their map. As you see, session complete. I actually got 80 points because they found a watchtower while I happened to be on there. Travelled 3.1 kilometres, blah, blah, blah. Session ended. So pull back out of that. Go back to continue, which is obviously now my personal private game again with my level of progress, where I've already delivered all the trailers and everything. Uh, it's loading me back up to Smithville Dam. If you remember, before I joined their game, I uh, I recovered to a garage in Smithville, so it's just brought me back to the same place. This is where I had a bit of a panic for a second because I forgot to recover and retain my vehicle. I thought I'd left him my bloody crane <laughs> with a 20 grand winch and stuff on, but thankfully when I went into truck storage, it was at the bottom of it. So uh, that was panic over, but anyway, I click leave game. I'm now back on my own game session again. I can change skip time again, which I couldn't in theirs, otherwise I would have done it in the daytime. And if I press down on the D-pad, L1 or R1, sorry, to go over the trophies, scroll down, and as you'll see, Goliath, it's now complete. So, and I didn't have to uh, restart my game or anything, obviously, because that's the thing. I'd, I've got no trailers left that are liftable, so this was the way I found uh, to get around it. So anyway, I hope that helps. Thanks for watching, and I'll be back soon.